All right, Fuzz Pie Guy here. What you're looking at is a wireless smart switch relay that one of the band aid uh, injured my thumb. But uh, this is a ESP8266. Got five volts coming in either here or here. And you got your uh, normally open, common, normally closed. Then uh, you got two uh, momentary switches there. So we're going to power this up. I'm just going to use an old battery bank here. <coughs> As you can see, we got some light activity. So to get this to work, you need to get on either Android or the Play Store or the uh, App Store and download the following app. Uh, get the name of it here. It's uh, E We Link. And it's the same icon for both platforms. So, what you'll do is you'll want to go under the uh, plus and uh, you'll want to click the quick pairing mode. I mean, you might be able to try that down here, but just go with that. So on, on your uh, relay here, you wanna hold this button down until it starts flashing fast. You'll get two flashes, then it'll flash faster. So I'm just gonna do it here. There you go. Now you'll go under there and uh, hit next and go on. The biggest thing that you need to know is <clears throat> this module only accepts 2.4. It's not a dual band uh, ESP, obviously. So once you have it installed and your thing set up, we can just, mm. as you can hear it and see it, it just turns it on, turns it off real quick. Mm. If you need to have it on all the time, you click that button, mm. then it's on. Mm. The nice thing about this is you can set up schedules and whatnot you can uh, do a multiple of different things. You have a timer, a schedule, a loop timer that you can all set up with this thing. And these they make these for different, uh, bigger ones for more channels and stuff. So you can pick these up off of uh, Amazon. But a lot of people hook these up to your garage door opener so you could use your phone and open and close the garage door or Wi-Fi or whatnot. Uh, some newer garage doors, this won't work. So you could take your actual garage door opener and what we'll do is, <clears throat> this, this one here isn't programmed to my garage door yet, but on the left side is the uh, solder joints that we're more concerned about because they're the ones that actually work to make contact so if we solder wires to say here then go to normally open normally I mean common but normally closed uh, then we can have this wired up to that and uh, use your phone or tablet and you can actually hook this up to Alexa and uh, do the commands through Alexa also so uh, I might show do a video on how to uh, set that up but uh, 
this garage door, you know, I bought this for only one garage door, but you can add obviously multiple switches to it. And that's what I did with my other one. But, uh, so what, I'm, what I might do is solder the wires to these two since this switch is already there and hook it up to this and uh, I'll be back. All right, I'm back now. I went ahead and just soldered this up here to the uh, to my garage door opener, and I have one wire going to normally uh, open, and the other one going to common. So I got my app here. So as you can try to see here. Watch this light right there. Oh, kinda. There we go. So there you go. I mean, that's all it takes. So I'll make another video on how to connect this to uh, to Alexa. So uh, stay tuned.